Hey guys, and welcome back to Team Raider. Uh, we left off last time having just scrambled up that ledge, and we're still heading for the radio tower to send out an SOS signal. So let's just jump straight into it. Isn't that got right, Gollum? That's right, precious. Hello. Oh, I'm totally forgetting all the controls here. This isn't good. Um. Oh god, oh god, oh god. I've really forgotten the controls. Ah, I've just been playing Sleeping Dogs. This is so hard. What the hell are the controls? Right, okay. What does shift shift scrambles? Oh god. Zed. Zed zooms in. Right. Oh. oh. Panic. Wow, that's oh, coming from one game straight to another. I was literally just playing Sleeping Dogs and I've been in a, a, a sort of a gunfight. And the controls to that game are obviously slightly different. And wow, that could have gone a lot smoother. Very bad feeling about this too. I'm telling you, Reyes, it's mechanical, not an electrical problem. Now, Alex. <coughs> uh, this looks like it might be a, an electrical problem. You think? <coughs> oh, hello. Hey. Who's this little fox, oh, huh? Oh, he's cute, huh? <laughs> hey, cute, it's Alicia. Alicia. It's my like daughter. That. Oh. Is this a camcorder that she just picked up? Or... Has she had this all along? Let's, let's get that from her father. Don't give him the attention. And yeah. I'll take a look at this. Probably electrical. From her father. This one. So I was on the walk, right? You're gonna spot a midnight mission. Hey Grim, time to button down the hatches. Hi, be right with you. Oh, is that rough? I was on the walk, right? And this thing comes looming at me. Looming out of the water was. So I give her a young Glasgow kiss, you know. Get shot of trouble nine times out of ten that does. Got a headbutt to the face. Took me a week to sleep that night off. And I've not touched a drop since. See you at dinner, Sam. Obviously this is a flashback to happier times when all of our crew were on the ship together. Oh, hello. Alright, can we take B-roll please? Thank you. Dr. James Whitman, filler 15, take three, and action. Okay, now take a firm grip, and then slice him down the belly, like this. Yeah, you got... Good Lord, cut, cut, cut! Cut. <laughs> Lol, how to gut a fish, what a fail. Is, is he coming back? <sighs> I'll go get him. Well, for now, Dr. The world-renowned archaeologist, Dr. James Whitman, it's just a fish. 
It's fine. Oh, it's just it's gonna be fine. And this is why I didn't want him on my team. He's useless. Damned reality TV business. I'm, I'm meant to be bringing culture to the people, Sam, not dinner. Uh, no offense, Jonah. The audience demands content, Dr. Whitman. You know that. So until we find the Lost Kingdom, we need footage like this. Come on, let's just take it from the top, okay? He can't gut a fish. He can't help me. He's useless. Dr. James Whitman, filler 15, take four, action. Okay, now take a firm grip, and then slice him down the belly, like that. I've studied them so much, I can see charts on the back of my eyelids. But if I'm not right about Yamatai being in the Dragon's Triangle... Well, I remember when you found that one of your father's digs. You ran up and showed it to me dressed in your penguin pajamas. <laughs> I was five <laughs> years old. It was my first find. Oh God, how old is he then? You've got great instincts, girl. You just have to trust them. Mm. That's what my father used to say. Now, there was a man that ran on instinct. For better or worse. He would have been so proud of you, Lara. We're getting closer to the storm. Well, whatever's coming, we'll get through it, eh? <laughs> you know what doesn't seem obvious is how this crew all came together. Who's funding it? Who's doing what? You know, what job does each crew member fulfill? Okay, Lara. Pull yourself together. They're counting on you. Not immediately obvious, anyway. Um, I just wonder if we can upgrade anything or not. Can't upgrade the bow. Oh. Uh, we can still upgrade the pistol, but, uh, okay, so it's just the pistol. Wow, oh, that's expensive. They're all very expensive. Okay. Now one of the things that's happened to this game since I've sort of been playing it regularly is um, NVIDIA released a uh, driver update. Huh? Oh, NVIDIA released a, dr a drive graphics driver update for this game and I'm wondering whether or not that's fixed the tessellation issues with uh, Lara's hair. So I may try it at some point to see if we can get back to ultra, ultra, ultra full quality on everything because that's just something I've had to disable with the tessellation. Um, fingers crossed though, it should be back to normal. Hey! Get that damn gun off me! Now, oh. should I kill these people for silent kills? I think I could. Can I silently take him out? I have to walk up to him and press F, don't I? Or should I just ping him with a bow? Oh, let's ping him. There we go. No one's come to investigate. Good. Oh, there's more people. Okay. Oh, now I can put another skill point in, but I'm not going to go back to that camp because we've just watched an extended cutscene and I just want to keep moving on, really. Now. There's the radio tower. Right, there's two more people there. And some cover over there. Ok, 
Okay, one more, and then... Right, sneaky, sneaky. Oh, what's that? What's, hey? Oh, that's to light the torch, isn't it? Alright, so we've managed to sneak past the torch searchlight. Let's have a quick look at what's down here. I like do like to explore for optional extras. Yeah, now I've been using the bow and arrow just because it's stealth, but... There's nothing to stop us switching to the pistol. But unless we can fit the silencer, then we are somewhat exposing ourselves. Why do all those guys look like zombies? Speaking of zombies, I've been watching the Walking Dead TV series a lot recently. Oops, that was not very stealthy. Yeah, I've been watching the Walking Dead TV series a lot and... Um, oh dear. Um, and it's really good, I'm really enjoying it. Ah, that's unlocked that pistol upgrade that costs 300. Hey, how many are there? Only one from the new wreck. It doesn't seem to be like a button to press as such that... Oh god. You only get a certain amount of time to draw them. Now. Where is everyone? This coin probably found its way into Japanese circulation sometime in the mid-19th century. Is there something I can discover about this coin? No, I don't think so. Hmm. Egg. Oh, oh god. Yeah, so how... There just doesn't seem to be a cover system in this game, does there? Let's get the gun. That's my main issue, is I kind of want some physics-based environmental interaction, you know, between these uh, walls. You know, I want to be able to hug the wall and slide along it, keeping out of trouble. Now, what's going on? 
going on with this gun? Hmm. Certainly a very, very different iteration of the Tomb Raider series, isn't it? She's a very different Lara. Um, sort of the reluctant killer. Uh, not so good at stealthing around the place. Um, you could almost say, I, I suppose, more gritty or realistic, but at the same time, it almost seems more action based and less puzzle driven. But then, you know, I'm still not too far into the game. World War II era. Japanese. Oh gosh. It's freezing. I bet it's cold. Alright, let's switch back to the bow for stealth. Cultists and religion, never a good sign, in my eyes at least. Now what can we do about these valves? I'm guessing we have to turn it off. I see a rat. There's a rat in the kitchen, what am I gonna do? Go away, you ratus. through the heart. Heavy leg damage will incapacitate and oh god. I did not think about him coming. Too busy reading tool tips. this torch to do? There must be. Lots of salvage. Now I wonder if I'd have shot this barrel with my gun, would it have exploded? What am I picking up here? Oh, arrows. Would it have exploded as expected? Um, or are objects non-interactable? Oh, hello. Oh. Well, as to, uh, an atheist, I suppose I should agree with that, but... Gosh. Wow, he came out of nowhere. Probably the torch that gave it away. I should uh, maybe not use that so often. 
I think in these situations I'm going to stick to the gun because they all know I'm here anyway, don't they? Really. The bow is just for... It's quite handy for silent stuff. Oh, am I throwing this, am I? At where? Uh... What did that do? No, I need to light my torch. Um... Now I could throw it through that hole. I don't know what that would do. What's that done? Not a lot. Now there's barrels. Um, yeah. Those blue and... F are they... I don't know. That glass looks weak. Oh. Oh dear. Can I just shoot it then? A lamp? Well, that should have burnt. Oh, there we go, it did. Now, I fail to see how this is more powerful than a bullet, but okay. Not is it? What's and I must need to throw it through the other side, surely. Um. No one leaves. done nothing as oh I'm so stupid I could have just climbed through there duh god I'm an idiot First room. Not good. Let's blow that place up. Now I need to throw the lantern through, right? Ah, hey, oh, wow. Well From? Yeah, it is, isn't it? No, who's still around? Assault rifle, huh? Or is it a shotgun? Submachine gun. Please. Yeah, I'll put him out of his misery. 
go to hell. No, well, that was quite merciful of me. Expedition field report. Obviously, those sorts of things, guys, you can, if you really want to read, um, just, just because there seem to be a rather a lot of them, I'm not reading all of them, um, or sort of frapsing the duration. Just pause the video if you want to read them. Oh, that's where I came from. Why did that shut then? Another one of those weird doors that just automatically locks itself. One thing I haven't figured out in this game is the... Because there is no sort of UI on screen display of how much health you have, so what are the indicators of when oh, when you're uh, running really low on health and are going to die? They don't seem to be too obvious. And disappearing weapons. Yeah, this is why I'm using the pistol fist, not the bow. But first, I believe there was an upstairs to this section, wasn't there? Father Matthias will set us free from what? This island? Bloody coat. Hmm, okay. Very strange, almost delayed echo effects on these footsteps. Way high up. 
Climbing again. Great. Fortunately for us, there is actually a radio shack just around the corner and I saw it, so we're going to go there instead. I am alone now. Um, there's a poster, but I have no way of lighting my torch unless I go way back. And I do like to complete things, but I'm not such a completionist that I'm going to go out of my way. Hot much? Oh, this is going to hurt, isn't it? That made me jump then. Oh, there's going to be a quick time event, isn't it? I hate quick time events. How I better work after all this. Right, I'm just getting ready to press E and F and. Oh, well, there we go. I told you I had to press F. Five rounds to the shot. Um, this is normal. Why isn't it normal when you're on a mountain? Snow on a mountain seems perfectly normal to me. Oh, wow, we have a lot of salvage. This brawler. Hello. Hunt is what I like. Right, three more skills. What's in brawler? Withstand more punishment in combat and live to fight another day. Never use dirt and rocks to blind your enemies and leave them vulnerable to your attacks. That sounds cool. Or... Loot again and corpses food, cash... No... No, I think we're gonna go for... Well, if we can't go for the hunter perks, which we can't, then the brawler one seem more useful than survivor. I think we'll go for this one. as I seem to be taking a bit of damage. And some upgrades time. Ah. Oh god. Um, let's finish off the pistol first before we move on to the machine gun. Allows for an alternate three round firing mode tap mouse to activate burst fire. Increases rate of fire. Yep, okay. Have that one first. That one next. Unless we can do something to this. 15 more rounds. Steady the weapon while firing. Oh, yes. Increases reload speed. Increases firing rate. No, we want the accuracy. Can we do another one? No. Onwards. Onwards with the adventure in the next video.